So this one's called Daisies. A small boy clutches tiny white flowers, picked beside prison walls, thrust carefully into jean pockets. A yellow center surrounded by white petals, extending outwards like a sun of truth. Many years ago, shortly after creating an ingenious technology to speed up the dissemination of truth and end wars, his father spoke of a son of truth as a guiding beacon for civilization. The small boy passes through prison gates, silent corridors, the frame of a metal detector, stern faces in uniform. Large hands check small pockets. The daisies are confiscated, sheepishly and awkwardly, another act of compliance. Water wells up in small eyes, but do not fall. He stays strong and thinks of his father. But small flowers are stolen, like a father was stolen. Where small flowers grew, there will one day be mighty oak trees. Future generations will take up the mantle. But we still have a chance to save them from this fate. We still have a chance to fix this so that they don't have to. Thank you. This one's called If. If what he exposed wasn't true, they wouldn't try to hide it. If his voice had no power, they wouldn't try to silence it. If minds couldn't learn, they wouldn't try to stifle them. If hearts couldn't unite, they wouldn't try to divide them. If there is a sign on the right side of history, it already has the words Julian Assange engraved on it. If there is a gong in the theatre show that was his trial, its metal has split from being rung so loudly and repeatedly. And if there is a bird that is about to take flight, stretch her wings and rule the skies, may it be a peace dove and no longer a bald eagle. Just one more. Trust Paul. If he knew that they committed crimes and he had a river of leaks on his computer screen revealing their felonies, if he knew that their empire is run by dark three-letter orgs and CEOs in camo gear, if he knew that they would chase him to the ends of the earth, if he knew that they are rich, angry old men capable of hideous acrimony and vengefulness, if he knew that humans have an ability to realise they've been deceived, to finally and critically and profoundly and devastatingly open our eyes, then this is a trust fall, an incredibly brave trust fall, and we are meant to be doing the catching.